Hi guys and welcome to my channel, I'm Anthony Wood and this is Shop Mad. I've been getting emails about a dowling jig I made some time ago when I first started YouTube and I've been asked can it be made out of anything else but plexiglass and the answer to that question is yes it can. So in this video that's what I'm going to be making, I'm just going to be making a simple dowling jig for 8mm dowels Well, I'm just going to start with milling some hardwood down now. I've got some scrap ash and I need it to be 35 millimeters by 20 millimeters, which is what this piece I've got here. Now, I just need to make the base of the dowling jig 50 millimeters or two inches long. So I'm just going to get this piece cut off here now. I think guys I've got the 50 millimeter long piece of ash cut now now what I'm going to do is I'm going to mark in either side 12 millimeters now this is going to be for the steel turbine which I'm going to use as a guide for the drill bit so I'm going to get this marked out now and then just mark 10 millimeters in and this will give you the hole centers for where I need to drill out the 10 millimeter hole for the guide tube. I'm now just going to cut some of this steel tube down to act as the guides for the drill bit. Now for the top of the jig, I'm just going to use some 12mm ply and I'm going to cut a piece at 120mm by 50mm. Now just going to mark in 34 millimeters from this edge in over. Now this is for the total width of the block I've just made with the guides installed. Now I'm just going to get this marked up now. And then half again so I've got a mark ready for the hole centre which I'm going to use as a viewing window so I can line up the jig where I want the dowels to go. So I'm just going to drill a hole out here now at 15mm with a forstner bit over at the drill press table. Right and guys I've got the base of the jig made now and the the guides are pressed in place. The top's made with a viewing window in place. Now as for when you're drilling the holes for the guides measure then measure again and make sure that your measurements are accurate because the jig is only going to be as accurate as you've made it. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to find the centre of the block and I'm going to put a guideline in place so I'm going to get that done now
in order to use the the dowel jig uh, all you do is you just line up your two parts which you want to join together make a line then just line up the jig to the line and clamp it in place and then you can proceed in drilling out the two holes for the dowels Now they've got the holes drilled, you're ready just to put in the two 8mm dowels. Obviously I'm not going to use glue to put this together because it's only demonstration. And there you go, it lines up perfectly. If you like today's build on the simple dowel jig, uh, consider giving us a big like and subscribing for new content being added on a weekly basis. Well, that's it for me for today, so until the next video, catch you later.